<laughs> good. All right, we are running the Echo CS400 today. Dude. <laughs> All right, dude. You ready for this? Uh -huh. All right. It should be less windy down there, okay? All right. This is probably good right here. Yep. This is good. Yeah, there's a creek. Yeah, there's the creek. What's going on guys? Welcome back to Hummel's Acres. So I'm out at the front of our property right now and I have this four-wheeler trail here. The problem with it is I have enough space to get the four-wheeler through but I want to be able to get my trailer in here too to collect the firewood from the trees that we've cut down. So in order to do that you can see I've marked a couple of these trees. I got to get rid of that one, that one, this one, And an, another thing is, it's hard to tell in the video, but this is a pretty steep slope. It's sloped this way down to this creek down here. So I'm going to have to kind of bench cut that out too and level it out a little bit. That one's got to go. That one's got to go. But as you can see, I've cut a bunch of trees down. And it's all really good firewood, but there's not a good way to get it up to my log splitter and stuff. So you can see how my four wheeler sitting right now. I'm holding the camera perfectly level right now and it is tilted quite a bit. So you can see we've got to, we've got to level it out. Uh, you can see that little bendy walnut in front of my four wheeler, that's got to go. And then right here is the worst of it. I don't, I've already cleared the trees out right here, but this slope is really, really steep. But what I want it to do is basically connect. We've got a trail down there, and that's an existing four-wheeler trail. So basically I want to level this out and connect it to that. The first things I got to do is knock down the trees that I want to get rid of. So that's on the agenda today if the rain holds off, which hopefully it does. We are running the Echo CS400 today.
Good. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'll open it up. Are you gonna help me load up the fire one? Mm -mm. Yeah, you got to. No, I'm gonna. I wanna go to my mom. Yeah. Ah. Oh, here, dude, I opened it. Alright, dude. I'm gonna take this thing and cut up the little firewood rounds. You can, can you throw them in the trailer? Okay. You can? Okay. Look at these right here. Like that size, uh -huh. and we can throw them in here. I want to throw that one in. Oh, we'll grab this one. Nice. Whoa! <laughs> Dude, you didn't even bring your saw down.
see if you can. You gotta turn it the other way. Yep. Oh! <laughs> nice, dude. <laughs> all right, we'll drive her up. Now we gotta we gotta unload all this firewood, okay? Uh -huh. Okay. There's the chickens. You wanna shut it off now? Nice, dude. Got some nice locust firewood, though. Who can carry this one? Oh, that's a, that's a big old cherry tree. All right, guys, it's the next day, and I made some pretty good progress here. Let me show you. All right, so there's the two trees I cut down earlier in this video. Uh, and then I just cut this one down. That one's right there. I got a couple little pieces of firewood. And so far, the trailer will be able to get in here no problem. I'm gonna leave these down here. So when, I don't know, I don't know if I'm gonna bench cut up here, because this isn't really too bad. I think the trailer will be fine. But if any erosion happens, it's gonna push some of this dirt down here and I want it to lean up against that. And that'll act as kind of a little barrier so it doesn't wash out too much so here's another one I cut that's actually those logs right there it got hung up up in here and I dragged it down with the four-wheeler and it dragged all the way up there which worked perfect because that kind of leaves a little barrier there so that is actually something that worked out a little ash gone and the trailer will be able to get down through there, no problem now. I cut these stumps out. That one. Had to get the big steel out. And then I'll clear all this out. And then next video, I'm going to make this a, a kind of a two video series. The next video probably won't be for another month or so when the weather starts getting nicer. Like I said earlier in the video, we've been spoiled with this weather. And we're we're moving back to winter tomorrow, so. But this, this is really where I need to bench cut it. And I'm gonna connect it down to our existing trail down there. And that's gonna be a lot nicer, because as of right now, our, uh, the trail that goes up right there is straight steep up this hill. So being able to come in at a slant like this and being able to get my trailer down through here is going to be awesome. Alrighty guys, that's going to do it for part one of this little video series. Part two, when I cut it in and actually I'm going to be able to get the trailer down through here to get some firewood done. That's going to be a couple videos down the road when, uh, when the weather gets a little nicer. So anyway, thanks for sticking around and catch you in the next video.